Uh, this is Doug Wrench, and I'm down here in Dover, New Jersey, um, at the ShopRite Shopping Center Complex, right on Route 46 on the eastbound lane in Dover. And it, it is the site of the Dover Speedway in the 1940s and early 50s, and it was a half-mile dirt track. Now, I'm standing here at the edge of the property where the fence is, and this is the exit to Turn 4. Um, if I look around straight ahead towards the, the building with the uh, kind of the uh, truss roof, arch roof on it, this would be the front straightaway. And they'd come up here and go into turn one. They'd come around this would be the short shoot and kind of go behind shop right here. That'd be turn two, half mile dirt track, coming down, back. Okay, and then we go off into the woods, which is well, the interesting thing there is that would be the end of the back straightaway and into the woods. And as we come up through the short chute and again through turn four, you can see kind of a banked nature to the track here. And it actually kind of still exists, at least in terrain. I mean, there's the, it's vastly overgrown, and there's obviously be, been some construction over the years. But, um, you know, this is where, where the track was. And, um, again, a half-mile dirt track held national A, A, AAA events. And drivers like such famous drivers as Ted Horn drove on this track in the 40s. So really kind of a big deal. And, you know, there's not even a plaque or a sign or any evidence to, to, to suggest to people that this was ever here. So um, just uh, want to give people a heads up. And there are a lot, a lot of things like this, you know, still little remnants of things exist. And it just, you know, these things shouldn't be forgotten. This is, a, this, the, again, this was a big deal in the 40s. So uh, Dover International Raceway.